Don't repeat the hurt, let it go. By 40 Days of Love Series. Whenever you pray, forgive anything you have against anyone. Then your Father in heaven will forgive your failures. Mark 11, 2, GW. When people hurt us, we have two natural tendencies, to remember and to retaliate. But that's not what 1 Corinthians 13, 5 tells us to do. Love does not count up wrongs that have been done, NCV. When we get hurt, we tend to repeat that hurt in three ways, emotionally in our minds, relationally as a weapon, and practically by telling other people. Referencing scriptures, 1 Corinthians 13, 5 and Mark 11:25, the message urges deleting, not repeating, the hurts we experience. It highlights that love does not keep a record of wrongs, but chooses to let go and forgive, aiding personal and relational healing. By focusing on the future and potential rather than past hurts and choosing love and forgiveness, we align with a divine directive that also brings about healing and forward movement in our lives. Love responds to hurt by letting it go. What hurt that you have rehearsed over and over in your mind do you need to let go of today? Why do you think it's easier to nag about a mistake rather than forgive it? Is it really easier in the long run? What do you need to change about the way you respond to gossip?